Bad news tonight for bacon lovers. A world pork shortage could be on the horizon, and the drought we've seen this past year is in part to blame. As Brad Edwards shows us, a world without bacon for some is like no world at all. Cancel Christmas. Breakfast is fiend because this little piggy is at the center of some confounding economic outliers. Woo-wee. Look at that. At 694 North Milwaukee, Chris Bacon's the masses. Luscious strips of God's unicorn. Tuesdays reserved for BLTs. And just imagine an LT. The demand for bacon would outcry the, the not being able to produce bacon. The summer sizzle and drought and feed prices are up. This state, the fourth leading pork producer and farmers now losing 40 bucks a head. Economically, it's not a good time, said the state's pork lobby. Pork's too cheap, so producers are liquidating, which long-term portends a shortage. A world without bacon. Utter sadness. Pork is more than just a budget buzzword. Google bacon in Chicago and discover bacon fest. Whenever there's a bacon story in the news, I get emails, people start posting on my Facebook page, people forward me links on Twitter because I'm the bacon guy. A lot of people reached out with the bacon shortage. Bacon guy Seth says the fest, which has grown to thousands in attendance and pounds of bacon in a few short years. Uh, even if there's a bacon shortage or bacon gets expensive, there'll be plenty of bacon to go around at Bacon Fest. Though it is TBD, we spoke to the owner of Patty Long's Beer and Bacon Pub in Chicago. They sizzle through 500 pounds of bacon weekly. He says right now prices are great, but he says the forecast is indeed reason for worry. We're live in the newsroom. Brad Edwards, CBS 2 News. Robin K. At least Bacon Fest is, is doing okay. Well, that's, that's, that's what the goal is, but right. that's a year off, so yeah. we'll see. Yeah, right. One more year to worry about. Thank All right, you Brad. very much, Brad.